if you try to do everything yourself, you will fail. And I use the word failure there because it is a failure moment. It's not something that, that will end your life and ruin you, but if you have goals of what you want to do and try to accomplish them by yourself without help, you will fail at that. It is extremely difficult to get anywhere in our life and to achieve any goal that we set for ourselves if we try to do it by ourselves. Advertisers know that we're all walking around with a TV and radio in our pocket now. We don't need to wait for the 5 o'clock news in the afternoon to get our news. It's delivered instantly to us. So advertisers are like, you know what, I want to move my money from traditional media over here to this instant media because that's where everybody's, that's where my customers are. They're not going home to watch 5 o'clock news. They're walking around one of these all the time. So I saw the writing on the walls like, you know what, I'm going to follow the money because I think there's huge opportunity there for people like me that have got two decades of radio and TV news experience to take that to the internet. If you can find something that you can provide that is unique and urgent, that people want, those three things, now you've found a business. Now you've found something you can make money at. Whether you're hired to do that or you start out and do it yourself, if it's unique, if it's urgent, and people want it, then you found a business model. So I want to make a list of everything, Chelsea, that you consider yourself to be an expert at. Now when I say, now when I say expert, don't, don't just like, oh, I'm not an expert at anything. I'm looking for things that you have above average knowledge about. This was my goal in college, was to kind of have this Swiss Army knife kind of skill set that I could be good at just about anything you needed. I could do it. Well, here's the problem that I've learned in the last year with a, with a list like this is for someone like me now, someone like me that is an entrepreneur, this can be damaging to an entrepreneur, to someone that works by themselves. Because as I started today talking about the importance of help, if you don't get people to help you to do things that even if you have knowledge at, then you're going to limit yourself in the ability to grow your business. Now, Chelsea, I need a list of the things that you're passionate about. I'm talking about the things that when you wake up every morning, not just this week because you're fired up at something new and shiny and oh, it's great. I'm talking about the thing that if you did it today, tomorrow, six months, six years from now, you'd still have as much energy and excitement to do it as you would today. It's the kind of thing that you'd almost be willing to do for free, but no, we gotta eat. Between the two lists, you need to identify one or two of these items that's on both lists to, be, to, to, to follow as a career path. Now, when I say career path, I'm not saying for the rest of your life till you're 80 years old and die, because our passions, sometimes we find new passions, sometimes we develop new skill sets, I'm but I'm talking about today and say maybe, okay, as a goal for the next five years, maybe, or three years, or one year, whatever, this is what I want to focus on. The key here is going after something that you're passionate and an expert about, and then that third step to see if people are willing to pay you for it, which you just told me you are getting paid for this. So now all of a sudden you've got something that you're willing to do for free, you're passionate about it, you're an expert at, and people are, willing, are, are actually paying you for it. You have developed a good business model. Because if you've got one person that can do that, or that, that will pay you to do it, you can get more. And you can start teaching people what you know. And this is one of the biggest things that I want to take away today, want you to take away today, is teach people what you know. If there's any other piece of advice, I, I mean, if there's just one piece of advice that I want you to take away today, is to teach people what you know.